In this video, we'll show you how to replace your windshield washer nozzle on this Mercury Grand Marquis between the year ranges of 2003 to 2011. Let's get started. To gain access to each of your wiper nozzles, you don't actually physically have to remove the entire cowl from the area. What you will have to remove is your five metal clips making their way across from the driver's side towards the passenger side. And then all the way over on the passenger side, you'll find that you have three Phillips head screws. Let's go ahead and remove all of this. Now let's use a pick or a small screwdriver to remove each of these clips. Once they're off, just go ahead and give them a quick inspection. Once all the clips are off of there, let's get those Phillips head screws. We'll start right in this corner. Looks like ours is broken over here. There's our last screw. Now at this point, you can carefully make your way to whichever side you're replacing. Once you get this lifted up, go ahead and use a small block of wood or whatever you might happen to have to make it so you can reach your hand underneath there safely. Now we can carefully make our way underneath this area. Find where the washer nozzle is. You're going to find that you have a hose that leads directly to the bottom of it. Gently pull down on that hose to dislodge it. Give that a quick inspection. Make sure it's still soft and pliable and it's not torn, worn, or damaged in any way. Assuming that looks good, go ahead and set it aside. Now let's continue on with some long nose pliers. Looking at this, you'll find that you have a squeeze tab on each side of the nozzle. Grab onto that, give it a little squeeze, and then you should be able to lift this up and out of the cowl. There we are. And there it is, friends. All right, friends, let's get ready for the installation of our brand new washer nozzle. Make sure you have it facing in the right direction so the squirter will aim at the windshield. Gently press it down into the cowl. Listen for a click and give it a tug to make sure it's completely secured. Once you've done that, continue on to the hose at the bottom. There we are. All right, so now that I have the hose installed on this washer nozzle, the process would be the exact same thing for the other side. You would just go ahead and transfer the wood right over there, swap it out, and then once you've done that, continue on by removing your wood. Let's get this down into position. Put in all five of our mounting clips and our three mounting screws. Start in all three of your mounting screws and snug them up. Perfect. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.